huge prize over the summer of football. How do you win? Well, if you've attended all three home games in January, you could be enjoying the Hello, ultimate boys. set package during the Today we are here Ed Sheeran's at the beautiful Victoria Joint Stadium. Now, this package you know what we're here for? To Today, that's right, the Jets play Brisbane Raw, okay? Fully catered box, overnight what accommodation, what we and limo transfers. We got a lot of action. The girls just went down 2-1, but the men to are attend. gonna come back and do All them justice. We've got a beautiful sunset here in Newcastle. With the ultimate fan experience, beautiful with ground. The player of your choice, and members, we haven't forgotten you. Your Rodriguez here again, if you oh, starting today. Matches. Hopefully, he will get a goal again. Unfortunately, Chamness has jetted away for the Asian Cup. The ultimate fan in China. The ultimate number but plates. We're introducing we're here with the number the plates from my plates. Show your support. Enough. Get behind our team. You can order yours today at myplates.com.au. We will be back. Catch you soon. Hello boys, we're at the stadium still. Game's about to start, we're very excited. Here we have John Jonathan and Alex Samankowski Hello. with a few words pre-game. So yeah, what do we think so, today, yeah, Jonathan? So I'm expecting a, 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 a big win, a big win. Um, Brisbane Roar coming second last, uh, should be an easy one for the Jets. Had some Brisbane fans talking some shit about yes. our fan base before the game. Um, we're gonna show them, we're gonna stick it right up there. Uh, Kids watch these vlogs. Um, yeah, we're gonna win. That's that's all I gotta say. Yeah. I'm predicting a uh, three nil. Three nil. Yeah. And how about you, Samankowski? Um, you know, on paper, it looks like a very promising uh, game today. We're so much uh, further them up the ladder, so it's looking like a win. Uh, only Mac did decide to start Rodriguez today. Bit of a controversial decision, as he promised he would earlier, but. We'll trust him on this one. He's starting foot up front. Um, hopefully he can uh, perform today and um, we can seal the win. Yeah, I'm going to predict uh, a 3-1 win. Yes, hopefully the depth of the Jets squad can perform out here against the Brisbane squad and hopefully with a pretty... We've owned... Oh, pretty lacklustre yeah. Yeah, so um, attacking third of... We do have Naboo, but yeah, Hoffman and Clue. We're stacked, we're pretty stacked. But, but we're stacked, so hopefully they can... But also, we did play three or four days ago, you know, you got to rest yeah, the big exactly. boys yes. but against the lower them. level teams like Brisbane, so that we can have that firepower when we really need yes. Yeah, we and didn't really perform that well on Tuesday night, so maybe yeah. we can improve that. Yes, hopefully the Jets do turn up today, put a big performance for the 13,000 or so fans that we have here today. Up the Jets. Come on. And they could never tear us apart. That's where the Jets play some of their best football. In transition. Now in the boots. Chesting it down and trying to tee up Jason Hoffman. Super goal from Newcastle. Stadium. A bit of a lackluster first half, but Jason Hoffman got on the score sheet with a beautiful dink 
Go to the keeper. A few chances to both sides. And we'll pass it down so the boys can share their thoughts on the half. Here you go, Mr. Samankovsky. Yeah, pretty much what Toby said. Hasn't been too exciting. We have had a couple of chances. Jason Offman's got us up 1 0. Hopefully, we can keep the lead and uh, hopefully make it 2 or even 3 0 and uh, keep a clean sheet. And also, hopefully, Rodriguez comes on in the second half. Very true. Um, great goal from Hoffman. Cheeky little dink over the keeper. Um, he's been on fire lately. He's been on fire. Um, yeah, we're really. I really miss Joey. Like, like I just miss his head. I miss seeing him. His smile. You don't really know what you've got until it's gone. But um, yeah, we're we're playing okay. Definitely a, looking like a, a title-winning side. At least, at least facially. Okay. Well, this is the most boring Jets game I've ever been to by a country mile. I'm so disappointed. I, I literally, they scored in the first 10 minutes and this, I think this is more me than them, but I just didn't like, I didn't take my shirt off. I didn't touch my nipples. I didn't grab anyone's ass. No, I didn't. Curtis pushed me into your ass because he blocked it. But he was just trying to give me a little like, so it wasn't real. a little late birthday present, you know. But I've just been so bored. I want to like just sleep. And I hope the Jets can do something to change that in the second half. A bit of analysis, yeah. It's just we're doing. It's just a bit boring, but we're on top still. And Hoffman, it's nice to see him pop up with a goal as he hasn't got a drop of footballing talent in his body, but he's, he's got a goal, so we'll take it. And yes, hope for a better second half, because I'm going to fall asleep if it's not. Sexy man. Um, what do you want? Um, so, the boys have been playing uh, so la la, really. It's been all right. In patches, we've been good. Brisbane Raw have been playing pretty well so far, but we've 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 able to minimise the onslaught that they've tried to put on. And rarely just been there've been no penetration from the middle. Maybe just mainly mean from the wing areas, attempting to put crosses in. We're handling that pretty well. But second half, I think if we get more on the ball and play more through the middle, and then with Rodriguez, we can try and play a bit more out wide. We can really hurt them, I think. And I really, they haven't really created anything, and they don't really look too flashy up front, apart from Macaroni, but he's been a bit isolated. So I think we can, we should be able to take this one from here and hopefully keep a clean sheet and have it a pretty smooth sailing second half. My thoughts, you ask? You're just a bastard! You're just a bastard! Macaroni! You're just a bastard! That's all, that wraps it up. Catch you back with any goals. You're the best is dead fight, that door's on fire. You're the best is dead fight, that door's on fire. Um, do you want to lift time? What? Do you want to lift time? Yes. Yes. Lovely. Okay. So the game has ended one 0 A very poor, poor performance for the Jets, in my opinion. So, um, Jonathan. Well, let's just say today. Today was more more about the result than the performance. Um, Jets just didn't play the best in that, especially in that second half. But um, we came out with the the victory, the W, all three points. And that's what more could you ask for. We've already got a nice goal difference. We're sitting very pretty. Yes, Pato Rodriguez was on fire tonight, I must say. Didn't work back again, but still on fire. The most disappointing Jets game I have ever attended. Honest, no, honestly, I have never been more bored and just tired and just wanting to go home after a Jets game in my life. It was honestly shot like not not I was not entertained in the slightest whatsoever. I didn't get to take my shirt off once again. I didn't get to touch my nipples, touch bumps, do anything like that. I was just so freaking bored. Oh my god. I'm not going to talk on it for too long, but at least we got three points. That's a positive.
I, look, it's just, I miss champness. I, I can't, I have bad stage fright. Um, honestly, I think it's just the champness effect. Uh, I'm just really gutted about this performance. It's being pedantic, but we really could have done so much better against such a shit team. I want 100% agree. But I just, we had a lot of chances, couldn't convert. Got the three points, not complaining. Uh, I disagree with Narveen. I think. The <laughs> what? Uh, I disagree with uh, Narveen. I think the boys, they went out there and they did their job alright, mate. They told, the coach told them, you go out, you play with passion. They played well, mate. But they didn't get to take it. Play, you play. Let's go over to Ivan and tell him, you yeah. play beautifully, Fuck mate. You, does. you play with heart, mate. And they went out there, they did their jobs. They got the result. And uh, unlucky here with Thurgate on his debut, alright. He could have got something nice, but we'll see. And uh, they, it's a, it is what it is, alright? And it is okay, shit. Okay. That second half, I predicted Jets to really lift in the second half, but they were really poor. Brisbane, to be honest, should have got an equaliser, although we did have a one or two chance to convert, but Brisbane really put the hammer down and they could have had one or two. But once again, luck's on our side for some reason and we managed to get three points, but honestly, if we we cannot have too many performances like that again. Today, the game has just ended and we're here with Harry and Louis. Okay, who was your man on that today? Easily. I like in the Charles. Harry thinks Petratos is the man of the match today. How about you, Louis? I don't really He doesn't really, he doesn't really know. know. Yes, Petratos did play very well. What did, you, what did you think about Hoffman's goal? Do you think it was lovely? Yeah. A lovely, a good shift. Yes, he was. He played very nicely. And you, yes. And what do you think of our new signing, Pedro Rodriguez? Yeah, he was good. Do you think he's good? Last week he got that goal and was good. Yes, he was a very good goal last week. He did have a good impact. Yes. It'll be very nice when he comes back. Who's, who's your favourite player out of all the Jets players? Oh, Donovan. Are you, you going to be excited when he comes back in a couple months? Yes. All their big players like Vargas or Donovan, Chambers comes back. It'll be very good. Thank you for the interview. It's been lovely. Thank, thank you, guys. All good. So, thank you guys for watching the vlogs. I lo love all the support that you give us. And uh, yeah, I did. I met Harry and Louis there, and a couple of other you, you other guys that just came up and said hey to me, and just um, said that you've been watching all the vlogs. And just yeah, I just love the support. You know, yeah. If you want anything else, just leave it in the comments, just show us support, leave a like, give a big thumbs up, you know, if you haven't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button, you know, you know, a bit of peace, love and prosperity to you all, see ya.